Yaya the giant panda is back home in China, arriving to Shanghai on a special flight to millions of fans on Chinese social media celebrating her return. For two decades, Yaya was on loan to the Memphis Zoo as a popular soft power ambassador in China's panda diplomacy. But Yaya, who's 22, also drew attention because of her patchy fur and thin appearance that ignited an intense campaign by animal welfare activists that resonated on China's internet, accusing the zoo of mistreating Yaya and demanding her return to China. Groups monitored the zoo's panda cam, launched a petition, even took out ads in Times Square and posted comments on microblogging site Weibo, where the hashtag Yaya has generated a staggering 4.6 billion views. The Memphis Zoo has repeatedly denied any mistreatment, issuing a statement saying their contract to keep pandas was coming to an end and, quote, after 20 years, Yaya has become like family and she will be sorely missed. Chinese experts who've examined Yaya before say she was born with a genetic disorder that at 190 pounds makes her smaller than other pandas and look a little bit mangy, something Memphis Zoo officials tried to explain publicly back in 2021. I certainly hear concerns that Yaya is not what you think of when you think a big robust panda but trust me we watch our animals very closely trust me they want for nothing and trust me our pandas are healthy calls for yaya's return were loudest earlier this year after the death of her mate lola at age 24 of what chinese officials say was likely heart disease after weeks of online debate, China's Ministry of Foreign Affairs finally weighed in, stating publicly the pandas were well taken care of by the park and loved by the American people. That there's even a debate over a panda is a sign that few issues these days are unaffected by U.S.-China relations. Before Yaya left, the zoo threw a farewell party for her with a giant ice cake and performances. After a month in quarantine, she'll live out her golden years in China, and her fans everywhere will be watching. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.